Greetings of Christ's peace and love. We continue our stewardship journey with our four-minute reflections. This month, we focus on the Eucharistic prayer, which is at the heart of the liturgy of the Eucharist. The Eucharistic prayer is said after the prayer over the offerings. There are four principal Eucharistic prayers, with other for special occasions. Different circumstances determine when a priest may say one Eucharistic prayer over the other. Eucharistic prayer 1 may always be used at Mass. Eucharistic prayer 2 is more appropriate for weekdays or in a special circumstances, for example, when Mass is celebrated for a deceased person. Eucharistic prayer 3 is preferred on Sundays and festive days. And Eucharistic prayer 4 may be used on Sundays in ordinary time. In each Eucharistic prayer, let us give thanks to the Lord our God is a beginning phrase. In the Eucharistic prayer number two, we pray, it is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Father most holy through your beloved Son, Jesus Christ, your word through whom you made all things, whom you sent as our Savior and Redeemer, incarnate by the Holy Spirit, and born of the Virgin Mary. The Eucharistic prayer is one of thanksgiving, a model for our Catholic way of life. We give thanks and praise to God. We unite ourselves with the sacrifice of Christ, and we ask the Holy Spirit to transform us so we can continue His work. We have learned that the term Eucharist originated from the Greek word Eucharistia, which means thanksgiving. Eucharist, then, is the very essence of stewardship. God bless you.